Hey everybody, it's Matt here and welcome to the channel. And if you can tell from the title and the thumbnail, we have some breaking news. So said that like superhero time from back in the day. So when it comes to this breaking news, if you weren't following Twitter yesterday, you weren't on Twitter, you may have not noticed some very interesting developments. Now, before we get to that, though, you might be looking at the lighting and wondering what, what the heck's going on here. So uh, we're actually in our Halloween in July spooky month. If you didn't catch the video we did yesterday on how to spawn DVD and Blu-ray tokusatsu Blu-rays, I would definitely suggest checking that out. And it is actually more apparent than ever because there is actually some discussion, actually some talk, potentially a leak, quote unquote, hard to describe as a leak, and I'll tell you why in just a second, that Shout Factory is actually going to be releasing some more Sentai DVDs and maybe even more Kamen Rider Blu-rays. And if not, then Kamen Rider DVDs. So we're going to get into that right now. So here is the picture in question. Now, the reason why I'm going back and forth on whether or not it might or might not be a leak is because it was actually initially posted by Shout Factory themselves. Now, sadly, I wasn't able to find the actual picture of the post itself. I don't know how long it was up, but I can tell you that it was removed. So did they put it up uh, a bit too early? They're supposed to put it up maybe today or tomorrow. We're filming this very late here. Or was this a viral marketing stunt? Because they know that if they put it out there for a few minutes, remove it, all of a sudden, all of us are sharing it all of us are talking about it on Twitter now here's the thing I lean more towards that because I don't think that they would want to end up uh, potentially having an issue with Hasbro and with Toei on this deal especially the fact that we have not had Super Sentai in the US officially on DVD since September 25th of 2018 it has been a long time since we've had official Super Sentai in the U.S. Specifically, it was Jetman and uh, did not know what was coming. You know, we had a leaked image of Five Man. I actually talked about this on this very channel. And it's funny because I, when it came to this new weekly schedule that we're doing, I thought, you know what? No more uh, news videos, potentially just some reaction videos. Uh, I'll talk about the reaction video a little bit later at the uh, towards the end of this video. But we were going to be doing that going forward. And it turned out that, uh, no, this is extremely important, and I have to talk to all of you about this. So uh, looking at this, by the way, if you're wondering where this image came from, it actually came from Anime Expo, which is currently going on in Texas. So this was pictured there, and again, shared by Shout Factory themselves, which I find still very odd, leaning towards the viral part of it, but hope so, because I really don't want there to be any issues with this release going forward. Now, looking at the images, again, we're not too sure if it's going to be DVD or Blu-ray, when it comes to five man of course it's going to be dvd um i don't believe there was a five man film and even if there was they're not going to end up putting a five man film in that set when it comes to kuga of course there was no kuga film there was a hyper battle video but i don't think that's really going to be in the set at all and i know that there was a again assumption on my end of course and there was a new year special that i highly doubt would be in the set at all now would it be dvd would it be blu-ray honestly when you look at what uh they did with zero one it would probably end up being blu-ray but here's the thing though the zero one blu-rays were blu-ray of course but they were tv rips or obviously tv uh versions encoded versions so when it comes to the kuga blu-rays there are no TV versions uh, unless they aired it on TV recently in uh, 720p, you would think. But uh, no, there are only Blu-ray and DVD. So what are they going to do? Well, I think that when it comes to maybe potentially saving money, making it cheaper, they would end up putting it on DVD. Or if Toei just doesn't want to give them the masters because they don't want there to be reverse importing because Japan's region, uh, when it comes to Blu-ray, and our region is exactly the same. So they might not even give them Blu-ray. So uh, these two to me just, uh, even though they're obviously, uh, I say obviously because of the fact that, you know, until they're in our hands, when you see any art like this, it's probably not the final artwork. When you look at Kuga, and I'm not the biggest fan of the uh, logo, by the way, but still, when you look at Kuga, to me, it looks very much like a DVD um, kind of just the, the scaling and everything very much looks like a DVD box art. But uh, again, could very much be wrong. And of course, it can change dramatically before it actually gets put out on Blu-ray or DVD. 
I will say, though, when it comes to five man, though, that looks very much like everything we've seen from Sentai so far. I have a bunch of the sets. I still don't have all of them, sadly. Gotta end up uh, getting some more, hopefully, sooner rather than later. I get all of them on sale, but uh, some of them have not gone on sale. One small clarification, uh, when it comes to the last Shout Factory release in the U.S. of Sentai, it was actually Hurricane Drew, one that I don't have, sadly, because it never goes on sale. Um, specifically came out in uh, March 26th of 2019. So thankfully it has not been uh, four years, but has been over three. So whew, it definitely hurt not having Sentai officially for a while, especially because we were getting them every other uh, financial quarter, three to four months. They kind of sped it up a little bit, at least one to two times, but for the most part it was three to four months. And it was an amazing time, uh, you know, as someone who's been a fan since 2009, to see these come to the U.S. officially. Not all of them were great. Uh, we'll be doing some reviews of them on both the releases and also some more episode reviews on this very channel. But when it comes to the fact that we're actually getting them in the U.S., I'm so happy about it. I hope you are as well. Would love to hear your thoughts down below, whether or not you're happy or not. Um, obviously, we do have Kuga on streaming, so you can watch it over at either Shout Factory, uh, specifically Togoshoutsu, or you can actually watch it on Tubi. That's where I check it out. Uh, it's a free service. It's not an ad. It's a free service. Uh, it does have ads on it, though, but it's free. So all the Sentai and the riders that are currently in the U.S. and the, the Sentai that are currently in the U.S., are on that service so that's where i watch them uh, other than the ones of course that i have on dvd already but either way i'm getting hyped especially because of the fact that one day we will have live man and i freaking love live man and also i mentioned uh reaction videos before so a new trailer for futo pi actually appeared at anime expo and it's up on youtube it's up on the internet but none of it are official channels so i won't be doing a reaction video for it until it's on Crunchyroll or some other official channel, maybe Toei's own or something along those lines. But as of right now, though, no reaction video yet. I need sleep. <laughs> I need a little bit of sleep between these weekly releases we have. So I, on one hand, I want some more information to come up. If any more information about this comes up, this is where you'll find it on this very channel. But uh, if there isn't any more breaking news about this, and this is still just in the, you tweeted it, but you deleted it, rumor but not rumor because there's pictures of it people are there at the event kind of thing then we'll just leave it at this for now but uh but if not then you'll see some more spooky lighting like this on this very channel talking about some more uh releases but either way thank you all so much for watching our breaking news segment so Either way, though, if you like the video, please remember to like and subscribe. If you don't like the video, you can still like and subscribe anyway. I won't judge you. I am not Odin. I am not a mecha from Zero Ranger. Who am I to judge, really? But either way, though, love y'all, take care, and see ya.